Hi, and welcome to another fantastic training session with Learning to Lean. Let's get started. Welcome to Learning to Lean's Yellow Belt course. This course is structured to provide you with the learning items that can broaden your knowledge of the concepts of lean, continuous improvement, and Six Sigma. This course is also intended to provide you with the information and knowledge to take the American Society for Quality, or ASQ, Yellow Belt exam. Hi, my name is Katie Lebeds, and I am a professional speaker, certified instructor facilitator. I'm a Lean Six Sigma Master Black Belt, project management professional, coach, and mentor. And I also own a company called Learning to Lean. Congratulations on saying yes to this adventure. Yes opens doors. No closes them. Yes pushes us. No keeps us safe at home. Imagine all of the opportunities waiting for a yes. Through taking this course, studying, and preparing for the exam, you are setting yourself up for success. So let's let go of expectations. You've done your best to prepare. Now let go. There's no other way your life should unfold. Enjoy the journey. Here are the steps you will take to prepare for and pass the ASQ Yellow Belt exam. Your first step is to go to ASQ's website for the Yellow Belt exam. Make sure that you read all of the information on the website. One of the cool parts about this exam is there is no requirement in regards to years or time of work experience, and there are no previous educational requirements. The exam is 85 question multiple choice. You have about two hours and 18 minutes to complete this computer based exam. It is done in English and it is open book and open note. You also have to decide when and where you plan on taking this exam. So I included a screenshot here for the exam dates for 2020. Please keep in mind that there's not necessarily an exam every month of the calendar year. So let's go. Now on to step two, purchase the certified Six Sigma Yellow Belt Handbook from ASQ. The ASQ link to ordering this handbook is listed above. Each module in this course will correspond to a chapter in that book. You can also take that book with you to the exam. Yay! Step three includes downloading the certified Six Sigma Yellow Belt Book of Knowledge. This is the basis for the exam and in which the course and the book are structured. Step four includes purchasing the required calculator. So you can't bring a fancy scientific calculator to the ASQ exam, and there's no exceptions to that. The calculator is very basic. It doesn't have any memory or any fancy features. You can easily buy this online or at a local store. The suggested calculator is the Texas Instruments TI-30XA or similar. And the final step is to create a study binder. Now, the study binder is the key to your success for passing the exam. There is not enough time in the exam for you to look up all of the answers, even though this exam is open book and open note. You don't need to memorize all of the material, but you do need to know how to quickly find that information. I strongly suggest that you create this reference binder to bring with you to the exam. It makes it easier if you copy the index and glossary from your yellow belt handbook and place those in the front of your binder for quick reference. You also can't take sample questions to the exam. So the exam proctors will review your binder and any other material that you bring with you to the test before going into the testing center. All materials that you take in your study binder or with you must be bound meaning that they should be hole punched and put inside the rings of the binder. 
So no loose paper is allowed. The information in each session is taken from the certified yellow belt handbook. In order to set yourself up to pass the yellow belt exam, you should read the book and review the information in each lesson. This lesson is not meant to take the place of the chapter in the book, only to present some topics in a manner that is more easily understood. Let's get started on this grand adventure together. In next week's session, we will cover Chapter 1, Six Sigma Foundations and Principles from the Yellow Belt Handbook. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you'll be the first to see the videos as they're released. Hit subscribe now. No, I mean right now. Thank you. Have a great day.